Ever had that uncomfortable feeling of not being able to go? You're not alone. Constipation, that dreadful sensation of feeling bloated and backed up, is more common than you might think. In fact, it's an issue that affects millions of people right across the globe every single day. This condition is far from a laughing matter, causing discomfort and even pain, impacting the quality of life. And the truth is, many factors contribute to this predicament. Sedentary lifestyles, insufficient fluid intake and stress can all play a part. But one factor that often gets overlooked is the role of diet. Yes, the food we consume can greatly influence our digestive health. It's not just about what we eat, but also how we eat. Certain dietary choices can exacerbate the problem, while others can provide relief. So, here's the good news. There are specific foods that can help prevent and even alleviate constipation. But did you know certain foods can actually help relieve constipation? Let's delve into the details. First on our list is the humble linen seed, small in size but mighty in effect. When you hear the term superfood, what springs to mind? Quinoa, kale or maybe acai berries? It's time to add another contender to that list, a tiny treasure trove of health benefits, the linen seed. These minuscule seeds pack a nutritional punch that's hard to match. They're brimming with dietary fiber, both soluble and insoluble. Soluble fiber turns to gel in your stomach, slowing digestion and helping you feel full for longer. On the other hand, insoluble fiber adds bulk to your stool, aiding in its passage and thus alleviating constipation. But the benefits don't stop there. Linen seeds are also a rich source of omega-3 fatty acids which are known for their anti-inflammatory properties and essential role in brain health. Moreover, these seeds boast a wealth of antioxidants which help to fight off damaging free radicals in the body. Now, you might be wondering, how do I incorporate these tiny wonders into my diet? Well, the best way to consume linen seeds is ground and soaked. The grinding process makes it easier for your body to access and absorb the nutrients, while soaking them helps to release the beneficial compounds they contain. You can use them as a topping for your morning porridge, sprinkle them over a salad or blend them into a smoothie. The possibilities are endless. However, like everything in life, moderation is key. While linen seeds are undoubtedly healthy, overconsumption can lead to a few side effects. Eating too many can cause bloating, gas and even abdominal pain due to their high fibre content, so it's best to start with a small amount and gradually increase your intake as your body adjusts. So remember, a little linen seed goes a long way in keeping the pipes clean. Uh, if you're enjoying this video, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel. Next up, prunes, the sweet solution to your digestive problems. Dive into the world of prunes, a humble yet potent fruit that has been aiding digestion for centuries. Prunes or dried plums, if you prefer, pack a powerful punch when it comes to fiber. Just a half cup serving of prunes contains about six grams of dietary fiber. That's nearly a quarter of your recommended daily intake. This high fiber content aids in promoting regular bowel movements, making prunes a natural remedy for constipation. But the magic doesn't stop there. Prunes also contain sorbitol, a sugar alcohol that acts as a natural laxative. Sorbitol works by drawing water into the large intestine, stimulating bowel movements. This dual action of fiber and sorbitol makes prunes a potent ally in your fight against constipation. Now, how can you incorporate prunes into your diet? Well, prunes are incredibly versatile. They can be enjoyed on their own as a snack, tossed into a salad for a sweet and tangy twist, or even consumed as juice. Prune juice, in particular, is a popular choice for many, offering the same benefits in a convenient, drinkable format. However, like all good things, prunes should be consumed in moderation. Overindulging in prunes or prune juice can swing the pendulum too far in the other direction, leading to diarrhea. And because of their high sugar content, they can contribute to weight gain if eaten in excess. So remember, balance is key. Prunes are more than just a dried fruit. They're a sweet, delicious and natural way to promote digestive health. So next time you're feeling a bit backed up, why not reach for a prune or two? You might just find that they're the sweet solution you've been searching for. Prunes, a sweet and simple solution to keep things moving along. Last, but certainly not least, licorice the candy with a kick for your colon. Now, licorice is not just your average sweet treat. This root, with its distinctive flavor, has been a stalwart in traditional medicine for centuries. 
From ancient Egypt to traditional Chinese medicine, licorice has been utilized for its impressive health benefits, particularly in aiding digestion and alleviating constipation. Licorice root contains a compound called glycerazine, which has a laxative effect. This compound helps to increase the water content in the bowel, making stool softer and easier to pass. But it's not just about bowel movement. Licorice also has anti-inflammatory properties, which can soothe an irritated digestive tract, making the journey of food through your system a whole lot smoother. So how do we harness the power of licorice? Well, there are a couple of ways. One of the more popular methods is to consume it as a tea. You can find licorice tea in most health food stores, or you can make your own by steeping some dried licorice root in hot water. And of course, there's the candy. Small amounts of licorice candy can also provide the benefits. Just remember to opt for the natural licorice candy, not the artificially flavoured ones. But, like all good things, licorice should be consumed in moderation. Overconsumption of licorice can lead to an array of health issues. The same compound, glycerazine, that gives licorice its beneficial properties can cause problems when ingested in large amounts. It can lead to high blood pressure, swelling and even heart problems. So, as with all things, balance is key. So, there you have it. The lure of licorice. It's not just a candy, but a powerful ally in the fight against constipation. But remember, moderation is key. Too much of a good thing can quickly become a bad thing. Licorice. A treat that's both tasty and tummy-friendly. So, there you have it. Three foods that can help keep constipation at bay. Linen seeds a powerhouse of fibre, provide a smooth passage for your food, easing any discomfort. But be mindful of the quantity, as overconsumption might lead to abdominal pain or bloating. Then we have the humble prune, a sweet treat that's not just good for your taste buds, but also your gut health. Its high sorbitol content acts as a natural laxative, yet eating too many can cause a laxative dependency. Finally, licorice, an old-fashioned remedy with anti-inflammatory properties that soothe the digestive tract. However, it's not just sweets and fun. Excessive intake can lead to issues like high blood pressure. While these foods offer relief, they're not a cure-all. Too much of a good thing can be harmful. It's all about balance. Incorporating natural remedies like linen seeds, prunes and licorice into your diet can offer a gentle, effective way to alleviate constipation, promoting better digestive health and overall well-being.